Welcome back to Food Related. My name's Tom, and today's video is about making a solar dehydrator. So here's a quick overview of this little homemade solar dehydrator. I've got this bit of clear acrylic that I had with loads of scratches on it, which I thought we'd reuse. Now the box is very simple. It's just, um, well, however thick this is, it might be like 13 mil plywood untreated. And all I did at the bottom was just use an old bit of fly screen mesh. You could use anything you liked. This is just to get some airflow. And as you can see, I've got some feet on the bottom just so the air can get underneath. Then the uh, bottom of the box isn't like rubbing on the fly screen. Just put a couple of little bits of wood inside. And then these plastic trays are actually recycled seed trays, which I just cut down and sterilized in the dishwasher. These fit in here really nicely. The acrylic goes on top and this works really well. The internal temperatures were getting up towards 35 degrees and that was in the afternoon. So I can't wait to see what this is gonna do during the heat of the day. So we've got some Louisa Plums dehydrating in the homemade dehydrator here, the solar dehydrator. So we're just using the warmth of the sun. As you can see, it's kind of a bit overcast and cloudy today, um, but the internal temperature of this box is still over 30 degrees. When the sun was out earlier, it was well into the high 30s. Uh, it's been cloudy for a while. I don't know if you can be able to pick this up, but just using an infrared thermometer, um, it's about, it's reading 36.5. I don't know if you can pick that up or not. Um, so it's really effective and these plums are drying out nicely. So I'm really happy with the results of this solar dehydrator. With just the power of the sun, we're dehydrating this fruit. And I'll tell you what, it is fantastic. So give this a go or something like it. Just use recycled materials. It's the way forward. Smash the thumbs up if you like the video and check out some of the other videos that are coming up soon.